of remembrance 18 years later. Honoring our loved ones lost on 9-11. God bless America. And recognizing first responders who risked their lives. Those who've died and others still fighting to survive. And more fallen heroes memorialized forever. We will never forget. Now special coverage, remembering 9-11. Here now a live look over Lower Manhattan as we take time to remember and pay tribute to the victims of the September 11th attacks. It has become tradition for those paying respects across the tri-state area. Good morning, I'm Chris Ragg. And I'm Mary Calvi. You're watching our special coverage honoring the victims of the September 11th attacks. Today marks 18 years since the terror attacks changed New York forever. This morning, many will honor the thousands of lives lost. The commemoration ceremony will begin shortly and last several hours. Right now, we are streaming live on CBSN New York. You can go to cbsnewyork.com and click on the red watch now button. The ceremony will also be streamed live. You're looking at Chopper 2 over Lower Manhattan, the changing skyline, a reminder of where we've been and how far we've been able to rise. There's also a new addition at the 9-11 Memorial. Visitors will notice a new plaza called the Glade. It's dedicated in honor of those sickened in the aftermath of the attacks. And the 18th anniversary ceremony begins the honor guard will enter and the national anthem will be performed. Once underway, the names of every victim will be read by family members. There will be six moments of silence to signify when the plane struck and when the towers fell. After the first moment of silence, church bells will ring across the city. The observance continues this evening at dusk when the tribute in light will rise from lower Manhattan and last until dawn. CBS 2 has live coverage, and we begin with Tony Aiello live in Lower Manhattan, where families are already gathering for the special ceremony. Tony. Barry, politicians who make headlines every day attend that ceremony, but they do not speak. The focus is rightly on the families. This is a day when emotions and memories that are so often held in check rise back to the surface, and our still wounded city honors the innocent lives taken in an act of hate. The ceremony unfolds where the Twin Towers once reached 1,300 feet towards the sky with six moments of silence and countless moments of heartache. This is more than a memorial plaza for many 9-11 families. The remains of almost 1,100 people who died here have not been identified. The family of firefighter Ruben Correa had nothing to bury. It never gets easier. As the years go on, it, it just, I still remember that day that we was told that Ruben was missing. And he was never found, so this is his, actually his resting spot. His, his memorial is here. So the days don't get easier, the years don't get easier. 18 years have passed since that Tuesday morning that started with a brilliant blue sky, soon to become a backdrop for unimaginable evil. Whenever you see the footage of the planes hitting the tower, I think that the feeling just immediately comes back to you. Just, uh, just that how, how can something like that happen? 19 hijackers had boarded four airplanes bound from Boston, Newark, and Washington, D.C., loaded with fuel for flights to California. 8.46 a.m., American Flight 11 crashes into the North Tower of the World Trade Center. 17 minutes later, at 9.03, United Flight 175 impacts the South Tower, and the world realizes there's a coordinated terror attack unfolding. At 9.37 a.m., American Flight 77 crashes into the Pentagon. At 9.59, the South Tower collapses. In the air above Pennsylvania, passengers on United Flight 93 realize what's happening. Some left voicemails for family. Please tell my children that I love them very much. I hope to be able to see your face again. At 10.03, passengers force the hijacked plane down into a field outside Shanksville, Pennsylvania. At 10.28, the North Tower falls. 2,977 innocent people died in the attacks. 15% of them first responders. The FDNY lost 343 members. The NYPD, 23 cops. Port Authority police lost 37 officers. 
18 years later, the annual gathering to fulfill what must be an eternal promise to never forget. The ceremony is part of a very long day for the families of the victims. Many of them attend a church or a memorial service. And the NYPD, the FDNY, the Port Authority Police all host luncheons for the families. Luncheons where memories are shared, laughs are heard, and tears are shed. Chris, Mary. All right, Tony, thank you. Let's get over to Elise Finch now for a look at the forecast as the ceremony gets underway shortly. Elise. Well, right now, uh, Chris, Mary, we do have 70 degree temperatures in lower Manhattan and temperatures will slowly be ticking up today because we are expecting a warm and humid day. Now, what we're also watching is to the north here. We've seen some decaying showers and thunderstorms. So while most of that is dissipating, can't rule out a sprinkle. But for the most part, between now and noon, we're expecting partly cloudy skies, warm, humid conditions. Temperatures go from 70 to about 79 to during the course of the ceremony and a little bit breezy winds out of the southwest between 5 and 15 miles per hour. Mary, Chris. Elise Finch, thank you. Eight years after its opening, the 9-11 Memorial and Museum continues its commitment to never forget to reflect and honor those impacted by the September 11th attacks. CBS News' Alice Gaynor spoke with the museum CEO about the annual ceremony. Alice. Chris and Mary, that's right. I spoke with Alice Greenwald just a little while ago. You know, this morning, the 9-11 Memorial and Museum is open only to families of the victims. It is a place for them to gather, to be in the presence of one another on this, one of the hardest days for them. Again, I spoke with Alice Greenwald. She is the National September 11th Memorial and Museum President and CEO. She says the museum also serves as a place for those who weren't yet born on that day to learn more about it. I think the greatest change in 18 years and certainly in the five years since we've opened the museum are the number of young people coming in who have no memory of this event. You know, 18 years, we're coming up close to the mark of a generation, which is 20. And already we have young people in college, people beginning their careers, um, who have no lived memory of 9-11. And yet they're living in a world that is defined in so many ways by the consequences of that event. Once again, the September 11th Memorial and Museum is closed to the public right now. It will reopen at 3 o'clock this afternoon. Chris, Mary. Alice, thank you. Today, dozens gathered in Jersey City for its annual 9-11 ceremony on the waterfront. CBS News' Meg Baker joins us live with more. Meg. Jersey City waterfront here on Grand Street is usually busy with people going to work. Today, it's a little quieter because of the reflection ceremony that you can see that's just begun behind me. Jersey City lost 37 residents in the attack on the World Trade Center. The area here along Hudson Street acted as a triage center. It's implanted in my mind of what I saw that morning. It's unbelievable. And I'll ne I, I put it on Facebook. We'll never forget. And I hope the people never forget. So there was a, a, a show of the greatest people, fire department, police department, EMT people, and the people of Jersey City were truly great. They're the greatest, and they helped New York City. I think we sent over 600 cops and firemen over to New York. I was with the New Jersey State Police with the Urban Search and Rescue Team, New Jersey Task Force One. So in that evening, we went over and we deployed search and rescue dogs, and we started our, uh, our search and rescue operations, and we stayed there for 10 days. The ceremony behind me is taking place around a piece of steel from one of the towers. We've seen dozens of people stop here for a quiet moment of remembrance before they head into the office. We're live in Jersey City. Meg Baker, CBS 2 News. Meg, thank you. On Long Island, thousands have returned to Point Lookout this morning, where 18 years ago they watched the attacks on the World Trade Center from the seaside vantage point. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan joins us live from the memorial service now underway. Jen. Good morning, Chris and Mary. We were here 18 years ago when so many spontaneously gathered at Point Lookout to watch the black smoke billowing from lower Manhattan. Then, as today, many wept and offered silent prayers. This is really the public tradition of sunrise at the beach, followed by a, a ceremony at the memorial. Right now on Long Island, we are at But We lost the people that... Uh, that I love, that I that I don't get to have here with me, uh, but it also is it builds me builds strength in me. Uh, you know, I'm raising three children, and I'm trying to uh, 
bring them up the right way and show them how the people that were in my life that I don't have anymore, they gave everything. We have the plaques of the names of all um, the residents who were lost on that day and since that day, the first responders who have been lost since that day because this is an ongoing uh, national struggle to deal with the aftermath of 9-11 as so many of our first responders and even people just living in that area are diagnosed with post 9-11 illnesses. The monument here includes a granite wall etched with the names of those who died in the attacks, as well as those who succumbed to 9-11 illnesses, as you just heard from Lieutenant O'Connor. We're surrounded by a meditation plaza and the 30-foot steel beam recovered from the pile at Ground Zero. This really is a lovely, moving ceremony with instruments, vocals, prayers, flowers, bells, and a lot of emotion. Reporting live this morning, Point Lookout, Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News. Jen, thank you. We at CBS 2 would like to extend a special word to the families of Isaiah Rivera and Robert Pattison who were lost on 9-11. Isaiah was a CBS 2 engineer who worked at our transmitter inside the towers. Now, Robert was also a broadcast engineer who worked there. Both men were on the 110th floor of One World Trade at the time of the attacks. Their friends here at CBS 2 send our heartfelt condolences to the Rivera and Pattison families. Now, deaths from 9-11 related illnesses continue to rise, and today we are remembering those who have been sickened or lost lives. One of them is former New York City Police Detective Lou Alvarez. Alvarez spent months at the World Trade Center following the September 11th attack. After developing cancer, he spent the rest of his life crusading for the Victims Compensation Fund. CBS News Dick Brennan spoke with the Alvarez family about his inspiring fight. It still leaves this empty void that, that my brother's not around anymore. Philip Alvarez remembers his brother Lou, a former Marine, an NYPD detective, and a 9-11 hero who spent months at Ground Zero. As much as I want to honor him as a victim of 9-11, we, uh, we were thankful for the blessings of having him so many years. Lou contracted stage four cancer in 2016 and battled for years, but he will perhaps be most remembered for the fight he helped lead in Washington, D.C. I have been lucky enough to have had 68 rounds of chemo. In June, racked by illness, Lou Alvarez came to Congress to testify, and perhaps more than anyone else, starkly made the case to lawmakers who were dragging their feet over renewing the Victims' Compensation Fund. His voice was soft, but his message was loud and clear. You all said you would never forget. Well, I'm here to make sure that you don't. Being that voice, being chosen to be that voice, and he was always wide open. He knew that he didn't have much time left. He knew what he had to say and do it that needed to be what he believed in. Alvarez inspired others, including comedian John Stewart, who blasted members of a House panel. Your indifference cost these men and women their most valuable commodity, time. With his time growing short, Alvarez was in hospice, where he spoke to CBS 2's Maurice Dubois days before he died. As long as God gives me the time, I'll be here advocating because this guy's in the Victims' Compensation Fund was finally signed in a Rose Garden ceremony, too late for Lou Alvarez to see it, but in time for so many who are suffering. Say a prayer for all the Lou Alvarez's out there, and they were all Lou Alvarez's that fought for what they believed in. Uh, they just, he just happened to be listened to it till, at the end. Philip Alvarez says that while this is the 18th anniversary of 9-11, it will be the first without his brother, whose final days made all the difference in countless lives. He didn't want to be any kind of star or hero. But he was. Yeah, I guess he was. And we're proud of that. We're proud of that. And there is a new place to honor those who died or became sick in the toxic aftermath. The 9-11 Memorial Glade, which opened in May, is a pathway near the 9-11 Memorial and Museum. CBS 2's Lisa Rosner explains the symbolism behind the new addition. Six heavy blocks of stone called monoliths look up to the sky, symbolizing resilience. It's a sacred place for 9-11 responders and survivors like Chris Cap. It really feels like home because I've, I've dedicated my life 
to paying it forward. The 9-11 Memorial Glade is an outdoor plaza of sorts with trees and grass, hence the term Glade. It's dedicated to those whose selfless actions on 9-11 led to their injury, sickness and death. People like Cap, who at 21 years old, set up a mobile kitchen and first aid station with the Salvation Army within hours of the attacks. We would help them wash their eyes out when they would come off the pile with soot in their eyes. So we, we were in that cloud. We were breathing in toxic everything. The Glade was dedicated in May, exactly 17 years after the end of the recovery effort at the site. Steel from the World Trade Center is woven into each 15-ton slab representing the scars. The architect Michael Arad explained on CBSN New York. These stones are sort of, you know, they're battered and rough, but they're not broken. You won't see any names included on the memorial because that list is constantly changing as more people get sick. Former New York Governor George Pataki was in office on 9-11 and remembers this area was the primary ramp for access to rescue and recovery efforts. Bodies were carried up this ramp covered in an American flag. The path leads to the 9-11 survivor tree, even touching visitors. We knew that a lot of people died here, but we didn't know that a lot of responders died here. There are more of us dying every day, uh, so knowing that there's going to be something about us when we're gone is so important. A place to remember, and now a place to heal. In Lower Manhattan, Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News. And the 9-11 commemoration ceremony for the 18th anniversary set to begin any moment now as we show you these live pictures on this beautiful Wednesday morning in Lower Manhattan as we look to the sky and see One World Trade right now rising above what were the ruins 18 years ago. But it's just a, a sight. So many thousands of people, Mary, on an annual basis come to visit the memorial, pay their respects on a daily basis. But today, obviously, we do it on a much larger scale. We hear those words, never forget, and we never do. Remembering 9-11 on this day 18 years later and we're looking at the striking blue skies so many people will commemorate will mark the lives of those lost there will be six moments of silence when the planes hit when the towers fell also the pentagon attack as well as the shanksville plane accident and now we are taking a look as the procession begins
Jr. Edelmiro Abad. Marie Rose Abad. Andrew Anthony Abate. Vincent Paul Abate. Lawrence Christopher Abel. Alana Abraham. William F. Abrahamson. Camera left. Richard Anthony Achetto. Heinrich Bernhard Ackerman. Paul Aquaviva. Christian Adams. <laughs> Donald Leroy Adams. Patrick Adams. Shannon Lewis Adams. Stephen George Adams. Ignatius Udo Adanga. Christy A. Adamo. Terrence Edward Adderley Jr. Sophia B. Otto. Lee Adler. Daniel Thomas Aflito. Emmanuel Akwasi Afakwa. Alok Agarwal. Mukul Kumar Agawala. Joseph Agnello. David Scott Agnes. Joao Alberto da Fonseca Aguiar Jr. Brian G. Ahern. Jeremiah Joseph Ahern. Joanne Marie Aladiotis. Sabir Ahmed. Terence Andre Aiken. Godwin O. Ajala. Trudy M. Alagera. Andrew Alameno. Margaret Ann Alaria. Gary M. Albero. John Leslie Albert. Peter Craig Alderman. And my son, my son Kenneth Joseph Marino. Being a firefighter is not a job, it's a calling. Not everyone can do what a firefighter does, and especially what they did on September 11th. Running into burning buildings when everyone else was running out, knowing that they may not make it out themselves. Yet they continued to do what they were called upon to do and saved many lives on that horrific day. As we all know, many firefighters did not make it out, and my son Kenny was one of them. He left behind his wife, a 20-month-old son, and a three-year-old daughter. But his spirit lives within his children, and he would be so proud of them today. While we are humbled by Kenny's actions and the actions of all the first responders, 18 years has not lessened our loss. Our lives have been forever changed, but we hold on to and cherish the moments we all shared. And my aunt, for whom I named my daughter after, Azucena Maria de la Torre, we love you forever. We miss you infinitely, and our lives have never been the same. Jacqueline Delane Aldridge Frederick. David D. Alger. Ernest Alacacos. Edward L. Allegretto. Eric Allen. Joseph Ryan Allen. Richard Dennis Allen. Richard L. Allen. Christopher E. Allingham. Anna S.W. Allison. Janet Marie Alonso. Anthony Alvarado. Antonio Javier Alvarez. Victoria Alvarez Brito. Telmo E. Alvear. Cesar Amaranto Alviar. Tariq Amanula. Angelo Amaranto. James M. Amato. Joseph Amatuccio. Paul W. Ambrose. Christopher Charles Amoroso. Craig Scott Amundsen. Kazuhiro Anai. Calixto Anaya Jr. Joseph P. Enchundia. Kermit Charles Anderson. Yvette Constance Anderson. John Jack Andrecio. Michael Rourke Andrews. Jean Ann Andruki. Su Nia Ang. Joseph Angelini Sr. Joseph John Angelini Jr. David Lawrence Angel. Mary Lynn Edwards Angel. Laura Angeletta. Doreen J. Angrisani. Lorraine Antigua. Sema 
David Ioma. And my brother, Peter Lewis Freund, and my cousin, Timothy Patrick McSweeney, both FDNY. We love you, we miss you, and you'll always be America's heroes. And my husband, Brian Murphy. Brian, we all miss you and think about you every day. I vividly remember your smile, which lit up my world, your generosity and kindness to everyone in your orbit, and your incredible zest for life. I also remember your adventuresome spirit, which is embodied in your two beautiful daughters, Jessica and Layla, who are having adventures of their own. You would be very proud of them. We love you, Brian. Peter Paul Apollo, Faustino Apostle Jr. Frank Thomas Aquino, Patrick Michael Aranos, David Gregory Aker, Michael George Archinsky, Louis Arena, Barbara Jean Aristegui, Adam P. Arias, Michael J. Armstrong, Jack Charles Aaron, Joshua Todd Aaron, Richard Avery Arno, Myra Joy Aronson, Jafet Jesse Arie, Carl Francis Asaro, Michael A. Asquith, Michael Edward Ashley, Janice Marie Ashley, Thomas J. Ashton, Manuel O. Asimbe, Greg A. Atlas, Gerald Thomas Atwood, James Otterfred, Louis F. Aversano Jr., Ezra Aviles, Sandy Ayla, Arlene T. Babakitas, Estas R. Bakia, John J. Badakliaka, Jane Ellen Basler, Robert J. Bearwalter, Andrew J. Bailey, Brett T. Bailey, Garnet Ace Bailey, Tatiana Bakalinskaya, Michael S. Bash, Sharon M. Balcom, Michael Andrew Bain, Catherine Bantis, and my uncle Brian Christopher Novotny. And my uncle, Michael J. Armstrong, we think of you always. You're never far from our thoughts. We love you. Gerard Baptiste. Walter Barron. Gerard A. Barbara. Paul Vincent Barbaro. James William Barbella. Victor Daniel Barbosa. Christine Gianna Barbuto. Colleen Ann Barco. David Michael Barquay. Matthew Barnes. Melissa Rose Barnes. Sheila Patricia Barnes. Evan J. Barron. Renee Barrett Arjun. Arthur Thaddeus Barry. Diane G. Barry. Maurice Vincent Barry. Scott D. Bart. Carlton W. Bartels. Guy Barsby. Ina B. Bessina. Alicia Christine Burton Basmagian. Kenneth William Basnicki. Stephen Joseph Bates. Paul James Battaglia. W. David Bauer. Ivan Luis Carpio Bautista. Marlon Capito Bautista. Mark Lawrence Davis. Jasper Baxter. Lorraine G. Bay. Michelle Beal. Todd M. Beamer. Paul Frederick Bettine. Jane S. Beattie. Alan Anthony Beaven. Lawrence Ira Beck. Manette Marie Beckles. Carl John Bedesian. Michael Ernest Beekman. And my father, Martin John Coffin, who was a carpenter from Tipperary. He was the life of the party, the guiding light of our family. 
and now our shining star in heaven. We miss him dearly. And my brother, Michael Joseph Zinzi. Maria H. Bear. Max J. Bilke. Yelena Belilovsky. Nina Patrice Bell. Debbie S. Bellows. Firefighter Stephen Elliott Belson. Paul M. Benedetti. Denise Leonor Benedetto. Brian Craig Bennett. Eric L. Bennett. Oliver Bennett. Margaret L. Benson. Dominic J. Berardi. James Patrick Berger. Stephen Howard Berger. John P. Bergen. Alvin Bergsong. Daniel David Bergstein. Graham Andrew Berkeley. Michael J. Berkeley. Donna M. Bernarts. David W. Bernard. William H. Bernstein. David M. Bray. David Shelby Berry. Joseph John Berry. William Reed Bethke. Yanene Bertru. Timothy D. Betterly. Carolyn Mayer Buke. Edward Frank B.A. Firefighter Paul Michael Bayer. Anil Tahilram Baravani. Bella J. Buchan. Shimmy D. Beagleson. Firefighter Peter Alexander Bielfeld. William G. Biggert. Firefighter Brian Eugene Bilcher. Mark Bingham. Firefighter Carl Vincent Beanie. And my mother, Arlene Ava Freed. Not a day goes by that we don't think of you and miss you. Your three grandchildren are here today, all named in your honor. Even though they are not fortunate enough to have met you, they know of your strength and courage, your big heart and loving personality. May your memory always be a blessing. And my cousin, Janine Damiani Jones. I wish I got to meet you, love you. Gary Eugene Bird. <clears throat> Joshua David Birnbaum. George John Bishop. Chris Romeo Bishontat. Jeffrey Donald Bittner. Albert Balawa Blackman Jr. Christopher Joseph Blackwell. Carrie Rosetta Blackburn. Suzanne Leigh Blair. Harry Blanding Jr. Janice Lee Blaney. Craig Michael Blass. Rita Blau. Richard Middleton Blood Jr. Michael Andrew Bacardi. John Paul Batchy. Michael L. Bacchino. Susan M. Bacchino. Dara Francis Bodley. Bruce Douglas Bohm. Mary Catherine Murphy Bofa. Nicholas Andrew Bogdan. Darren Christopher Bohan. Lawrence Francis Boisseau. Vincent M. Boland Jr. Tori Hambavi Balarchi. Alan Bondarenko. Andre Bonor. Colin Arthur Bonnet. Frank J. Bonamo. Yvonne Lucia Bonamo. Sean Booker Sr. Kelly Ann Booms. Canfield D. Boone. Mary Jane Booth. Sherry Ann Bordeaux. Christine Bordenabe. Jerry J. Borg. Martin Michael Borisevsky. Richard Edward Bosco. And my aunt, Gabriella Silvino Weisman, who I never got to meet, but who I've heard many great things about and who I love very much. And my twin brother, Ian Schneider. We miss you dearly, Ian. Hardly a day goes by where we don't laugh at something you said or did, but we don't wish you were with us. If you were here, you would be so proud of how Cheryl, Rachel, Sophie, and Jake have persevered and thrived. And boy, are you terribly missed by Mary Jo, Christine, and Drew. And we are so, so sorry that Michael P., Brittany, and especially beautiful Joy, 
never got to meet the one and only great Ian Schneider. We miss and love you, Ian. Carol Marie Bouchard. J. Howard Bolton. Francisco Eligio Baudier. Thomas Harold Bowden Jr. Donna M. Bowen. Kimberly S. Bowers. Frederick Nicole Bowers. Larry Bowman. Sean Edward Bowman Jr. Kevin L. Bowers. Gary R. Fox. Gennady Boyarski. Pamela Boyce. Alan P. Boyle. Michael Boyle. Alfred J. Rocca. Sandra Canetti Brace. Kevin Hugh Bracken. Sandy Wall Brackshaw. David Brian Brady. Alexander Burkensky. Nicholas W. Brandmarty. Daniel Raymond Brandhorse. David Reed Gamboa Brandhorse. Michelle Renee Bratton. Patrice Brout. Lydia Estelle Bravo. Ronald Michael Breitweiser. Edward A. Brennan III. Frank H. Brennan. Michael E. Brennan. Peter Brennan. Thomas Moore Brennan. Daniel J. Brethel. Gary Lee Wright. Jonathan Eric Riley. Mark A. Brisman. Paul Gary Bristow. Marion R. Britton. And my brother Robert R. Talhami. I miss you. We miss you. Mom and Dad are now up there with you. And I can't wait to see all of you soon. Thank you. And Kevin L. Bowser. Brother, father, husband, cousin, friend. Your good spirit and legacy is with us every day. And thank you, David, for sharing his legacy all over the world. Mark Francis Broderick. Herman Charles Broghammer. Janice Jolice Brown. Bernard C. Brown II. Mark Bruce. Lloyd Stanford Brown. Andrew Brown. Bettina B. Brown Radburn. Ronald Booker. Richard George Bruhert. Greg J. Buck. Vincent Edward Brunton. Nancy Claire Boucher. Brandon J. Buchanan. John Edward Bulaga, Jr. Dennis Buckley. Christopher L. Burford. Patrick Joseph Buse. Thomas Daniel Burke. Stephen Bruce Bun Bunnin. Charles F. Burlingame III. Matthew J. Burke. Donald J. Burns. William Francis Burke, Jr. Keith James Burns. Thomas E. Burnett, Jr. Irina Busolo. Kathleen Ann Burns. Thomas M. Butler. John Patrick Burnside. Timothy G. Burns. 
Milton G. Bustillo. Jesus Natali Cabezas. Patrick Dennis Byrne. Brian Joseph Caccia. Daniel M. Caballero. And my cousin, Thomas F. Swift. Your family misses you. You'll always be remembered. Lillian Cacheris. Stephen Dennis Caffiero, Jr. And my son, my beloved son, Joshua Todd Aaron. Josh, there are no words to tell you how much you are missed. How much I, we remember and miss you, your intelligence, your humor, and your love. Every day is less valuable without you. Richard Michael Caggiano. Cecile Vareja Kakikla. John Brett Cahill. Michael John Cahill. Scott Walter Cahill. Thomas Joseph Cahill. George C. Kane. Salvatore B. Calabro. Joseph M. Calandrillo. Philip V. Calcagno. Edward Calderon. Jose O. Calderon Omedo. Kenneth Marcus Caldwell. Dominic E. Calia. Felix Bobby Calixte. Francis Joseph Callahan. Liam Callahan. Suzanne M. Kelly. Gino Luigi Calvi. Rocco Camash. Michael F. Camarado. David Odie Campbell. Jeffrey Thomas Campbell. Robert Arthur Campbell. Sandra Patricia Campbell. Sean Thomas Canavan. John A. Candela. Vincent A. Cangelosi. Stephen J. Cangelosi. Lisa Bella Canapa. Brian Canazaro. Michael R. Canty. Louis Anthony Caparici. Jonathan Neth Capello. James Christopher Cappers. Richard Michael Caproni. Jose Manuel Cardona. Dennis M. Carey Sr. Edward Carlino. Michael Scott Carlo. And my brother, Donald W. Robertson Jr. Donnie, words cannot express how you are missed and loved. Your legacy lives on in your four beautiful children, Michael, Matthew, Madison, and Kevin, as well as your friends and family, and also through Team Shamrock. We choose to remember how you lived, not how you left us. God bless you all, and God bless America. And our cousin, firefighter Thomas Anthony Casoria, you are loved and you are missed. As we remember and honor all those who died on 9-11 and their families, let us not forget those first responders who have died since 9-11 and their families. And pray for all those first responders who have or will become ill as a result of their dedication and sacrifice at Ground Zero. God bless us all and God bless America. David G. Carlone. Rosemary C. Carlson. Mark Stephen Carney. Joyce N. Carpinetto. Jeremy Kaz Carrington. Michael C. Carroll. Peter J. Carroll. James Joseph Carson, Jr. Christopher Michael Kurtzingen. Angeline C. Carter. James Marcel Cartier. Sharon Ann Carver. Vivian Casteldick. John Francis Casaza. Paul Regan Cassio. Neely Ann Heffernan Casey. William Joseph Cashman. Thomas Anthony Casoria. William o Otto Casper. 
Alejandro Castaño. Arcelia Castillo. Leonard M. Castriano. Jose Ramon Castro. William E. Caswell. Richard G. Cattarelli. Christopher Sean Caton. Robert John Caulfield. Mary Teresa Caulfield. Judson Cavalier. Michael Joseph Cawley. Jason David Kane. Juan Armando Sabalos. Marsha G. Cecil Carter. Jason Michael Cephalou. Thomas Joseph Selick. Anna Mercedes Centeno. Joni Sesta. John J. Chatta. Jeffrey Mark Chernoff. Swarna Chalasani. And my grandfather, Gerard A. Barbara. FDNY Assistant Chief of Department Gerard A. Barbara, Incident Commander of the South Tower Rescue Operations, who was a brave, encouraging, heart and hardworking man. He never gave up on the work he started, always used to make people laugh, and of course made the job get done right, right the first time. He had two children and a wonderful wife. If he was still alive, I would not only think of him as my grandfather, but my role model. I love him with all my heart, and I shall never forget him. I love you, Papa Jerry. God bless all our families on this difficult day, and God bless America. And my uncle, firefighter Joseph Patrick Henry. Uncle Joey, I wish I got to know you, and I love hearing stories about you. I'm honored to be named after you, and I know that you're watching over us right now. William A. Chalkoff. Eli Shallow. Charles Lawrence Chan. Mandy Chang. Rosa Maria Chapa. Mark Lawrence Charette. David M. Charlebois. Gregorio Manuel Chavez. Pedro Francisco Checo. Douglas McMillan Cherry. Stephen Patrick Cherry. Vernon Paul Cherry. Nestor Julio Chevalier, Jr. Sweet Joseph Chevalier. Alexander H. Chiang. Dorothy J. Chirichiaro. Luis Alfonso Chimbo. Robert Chin. Eddie Wing Wei Ching. Nicholas Paul Chiafalo. John G. Chipura. Peter A. Chirichillo. Catherine Ellen Chirils. Kyung Hee Casey Chio. Abul K. Chowdhury. Mohammed Salahuddin Chowdhury. Kirsten Lael Christoph. Pamela Chu. Stephen Paul Chupnik. Y. Ching Chong. Christopher Chia Fardini. Alex F. Chicone. Francis Ann Silente. Elaine Shillow. Edna Cintron. Nestor Andre Cintron III. Robert D. Siri Sr. Juan Caballos since excuse me. Juan Pablo Cineros and my husband Benjamin Keith Clark. To some he was a great chef. <laughs> to some he's an unsung hero. To us he'll always be loved, he'll always be missed. He'll always be our hero. Um, we're expecting our first grand and so many milestones that he's missed. So please excuse me if I stumble over any of the names with all respect to our lost loved ones. This one is kind of hard. Eugene Clark and my uncle John Patrick Hart. We all love and miss you, and we'll lead, lead on through your legacy. Greg Zerviali, Clark. Manny Leroy Clark. Sarah M. Clark. Thomas R. Clark. 
Christopher Robert Clark. Donna Marie Clark. Michael J. Clark. Surya Rachel Emma Clark. Kevin Francis Cleary. James D. Clear. Jeffrey Double A. Cloud. Susan Marie Klein. Stephen Coakley. Jeffrey Allen Cole. Patricia A. Cody. Daniel Michael Coffey. Jason Matthew Coffey. Florence G. Cohen. Kevin S. Cohen. Anthony Joseph Calodonado. Mark Joseph Coleo. Stephen J. Coleo. Chris Tuff or Michael Colasanti. Kevin Nathaniel Colbert. Michelle P. Colbert. Keith E. Coleman. Scotch Thomas Coleman. <laughs> Terrell Coleman. Liam Joseph Colhoon. Robert D. Colin. Robert J. Call. Jean Marie Collin. John Michael Collins. Michael L. Collins. Thomas Joseph Collins. Joseph Kent Collison. Jeffrey Dwayne Coleman. Patricia Malia Kaladner. Linda M. Cologne. Saul E. Cologne. And my father, Richard Aronel. I love you very much. I miss you. My brother. I love you very much. I miss you. My brother, Richard Avery Aronel. William's father. We love him. We miss him. We will never forget. Thank you. Ronald Edward Comer. Jaime Concepcion. Albert Conde. Denise Conley. Susan P. Conlin. Margaret Mary Connor. Cynthia Marie Lise Connolly. John E. Connolly Jr. James Lee Connor. Jonathan M. Connors. Kevin Patrick Connors. Kevin F. Conroy. Brenda E. Conway. Dennis Michael Cook. Helen D. Cook. Jeffrey W. Coombs. John A. Cooper. Julian T. Cooper. Joseph John Capo Jr. Gerard J. Coppola. Joseph Albert Corbett. John J. Corcoran III. Alejandro Cordero. Robert Joseph Cordes. Ruben D. Correa. Danny A. Correa Gutierrez. Georgine Rose Corrigan. James J. Corrigan. Carlos Cortez Rodriguez. Kevin Michael Cosgrove. Dolores Marie Costa. Digna Alexandra Costanza. Charles Gregory Costello Jr. Michael S. Costello. Asia S. Cotton. Conrad Kofi Katoy Sr. Martin John Coughlin. John G. Coughlin. Timothy J. Coughlin. And James, my, oh, I'm sorry. sorry. James E. Cove. And my dad, Dennis Michael Cook. It's been 18 years, and we wish you were here with us every day. We love you. And my brother-in-law, firefighter John Chapora, who exemplified kindness, compassion, bravery, and a strong sense of duty. 
Serving our country as a U.S. Marine, John narrowly survived the Beirut bombing. After that, he would always say, my life is a gift. So he lived a giving life. He came home to serve his city and the NYPD. He died as a firefighter, helping people escape the South Tower. That's just who he was. But John would not want me to dwell on him or his service. He would point to the memory of everyone whose lives were lost that day, and the over 2,000 people who died of 9-11 related illnesses since then. Also to our military who have made the ultimate sacrifice. And to those who still suffer physically and psychologically, we acknowledge you too. He would be overjoyed that his sister Nancy escaped the North Tower and proud that his brother Gerard, the captain standing behind me, has dedicated his life and career to helping FDNY families in their grief. Thank you for listening to all these names. Never forget. Keep smiling on us, John. Semper Fi. Andre Colin Cox. Frederick John Cox. James Raymond Coyle. Michelle Coyle Eula. Christopher Seaton Kramer. Eric A. Cranford. Denise Elizabeth Frant. James Leslie Crawford Jr. Robert James Crawford. Tara Kathleen Creamer. Joanne Mary Cregan. Lucia Crefasi. John A. Crecy. Daniel Hal Chrisman. Dennis A. Cross. Kevin R. Crotty. Thomas G. Crotty. John R. Crow. Wells Remy Crowther. Robert L. Cruikshank. John Robert Cruz. Grace Ilegre Cuba. Kenneth John Cubas. Francisco Cruz Cubero. Thelma Cuccinello. Richard Joseph Cudina. Neil James Cudmore. Thomas Patrick Cullen III. Joan Cullinan. Joyce Rose Cummings. Brian Thomas Cummings. Michael Joseph Cunningham. Robert Curitolo. Lawrence Damien Curia. Paul Dario Curioli. Patrick Joseph Curavan. Beverly L. Curry. Andrew Peter Charles Curry Green. Michael Sean Curry. Patricia Cushing. And my brother, FTNY Battalion Chief Oreo Joseph Farmer. Oreo, it is hard to believe it has been 18 years, but you have always remained in our thoughts, in our hearts, and deep in our souls. Dana, Keith, and Alyssa, and your three beautiful grandchildren all embody your life and spirit. We will always love you and miss you, and most of all, we will never forget you. And my father, firefighter Jonathan Lee Ielpi. Andrew, Mom and I miss you very much every day, and we know you're watching over us. We love you a lot. Gavin Kushney. Caleb Aaron Dacht, Carlos S. DeCosta, Jason M. Dahl, Brian Paul Dale, John Delara, Vincent Gerard D'Amadeo, Thomas A. Damaskinos, Jack L. D'Ambrosi Jr., Janine Damiani Jones, Manuel Joel DeMoto, Patrick W. Danahy. Mary Danatino. Vincent G. Dans. Dwight Donald Darcy. Elizabeth Ann Darling. Annette Andrea Dotteram. Edward A. Diatri. Michael D. Dioria. Lawrence Davidson. Michael Allen Davidson. Scott Matthew Davidson. Titus Davidson. Nyurka Davila. Ada M. Davis. Clinton Davis Sr. Wayne Terriel Davis. Anthony Richard Dawson. Calvin Dawson. Edward James Day. William Thomas Dean. Robert J. DeAngelis, Jr. 
Thomas Patrick DeAngelis. Dorothy Alma De Araujo. Anna Gloria Pocasandra de Barriera. Tara E. DeBeck. James D. Debenure. Anna M. DeBin. James V. De Blase Jr. Giserel Malabuyak de Cherves. And my beloved son, Kevin James Murphy, who I hold close to my heart and think about daily. You would be so proud of your now grown up children, Caitlin and Connor, and the wonderful job your wife, Beth, has done raising them. I love you and miss you, but I picture you often up in heaven, together with your father, looking down on all your family with pride and joy. And my uncle, John Patrick Gallagher, keep shining down on us, big guy. Paul DeCola. Gerald F. DeCanto. Simon Maresh Debrukash. Jason Christopher DeFazio. David A. DeFeo. Jennifer DeJesus. Monique Effie DeJesus. Nareda DeJesus. Emmy De La Pena. Donald Arthur De La Pena. Azucena Maria De La Torre. Vito Joseph De Leo. Danielle Ann Deli. Andrea De La Bella. Joseph A. De La Pietra. Palmina De La Gatti. Colleen Ann De Lowry. Joseph De Luca. Manuel Del Valle Jr. Francis Albert DiMartini. Anthony DeMoss. Martin N. DeMeo. Francis Deming. Carol Keyes Demitz. Kevin Dennis. Thomas Francis Dennis Sr. Jean C. De Palma. Jose Nicholas De Pena. Robert John Durani. Michael DiRienzo. David Paul DeRubio. Jamal Legas DeSantis. Christian Louis DeSimone. Edward DeSimone III. Andrew J. Desperito. Michael Jude Desposito. Cindy Ann Duell. Melanie Louise DeVere. Jerry DeVito. Robert P. Devitt Jr. And my husband, Bernard Petronico. We've learned how to live without you, but we will never forget you and we miss you always. And my brother, Khalid Mohammed Shaheed. Your beautiful spirit and contagious smile lives on through your four nieces and one nephew who bears your name. Not a day goes by that you aren't in our thoughts and memories. Keep shining down on us, big bro. We love you, miss you, and will never forget. God bless you, and God bless us all. Devlin, Gerard P. Dewan, Sulemanali Kasamali Danani, Michael Louis Diagostino, Matthew Diaz, Nancy Diaz, Abdulio Ruiz Diaz, Michael A. Diaz Piedra III, Judith Burgess Diaz Sierra, Patrick Florence Di Chiara, Ronnie Dickens, Jerry P. Dickerson, Joseph Dermot Dickey Jr. Lawrence Patrick Dickinson. Michael D. Dio. John DeFado. Vincent Francis DeFazio. Carl Anthony DeFranco. Donald Joseph DeFranco. John D. Giovanni. Eddie A. Dillard. Deborah Ann DiMartino. 
David DiMeglio. Stephen Patrick Demino. William John Dimling. Marissa Denardo Shaw. Christopher Moore Dinkoff. Jerry Mark Dingle. Rena Sam Denou. Anthony Dionisio. George D. Pascal. Joseph D. Pilato. Douglas Frank Di Stefano. Donald Americo de Tulio. Ramsey A. Duani. Johnny Doctor Jr. John Joseph Doretti. Melissa Candida Doy. Brendan Dolan. Robert E. Dolan Jr. And my uncle, Lonel Jeronimo Morocho Morocho, and my aunt, Blanca Robertina Morocho Morocho, who were siblings that day, who died in the towers. We love and miss you so much. You'll always be in our hearts. And my brother, Lieutenant Michael Francis Lynch, Ladder 4. The heroism that you showed that day and all the first responders and civilians were, was amazing. We miss you and love you. Neil Matthew Dollard. James Domenico. Benilda Pasqua Domingo. Alberto Dominguez. Carlos Dominguez. Jerome Mark Patrick Dominguez. Kevin W. Donnelly. Jacqueline Donovan. William H. Donovan. Stephen Scott Dorf. Thomas Dowd. Kevin Christopher Dowden. Mary Yolanda Dowling. Raymond Matthew Downey Sr. Frank Joseph Doyle. Joseph Michael Doyle. Randall L. Drake. Patrick Joseph Driscoll. Stephen Patrick Driscoll. Charles A. Droz III. Myrna A. Duarte. Luke A. Dudek. Christopher Michael Duffy. Gerard J. Duffy. Michael Joseph Duffy. Thomas W. Duffy. Antoinette Duger. Jackie Saig Dugan. Sarive Ducat. Patrick Dunn. Felicia Gail Dunn Jones. Christopher Joseph Dunn. Richard Anthony Dunstan. Patrick Thomas Dwyer. Joseph Anthony Ekobachi. John Bruce Eagleson. Edward T. Earhart. Robert Douglas Eaton. Dean Philip Eberling. Margaret Ruth Ekterman. And my precious daughter, Suzanne Rose Kondratenko. There are no words. Your family loves and misses you every day, and you will live in my heart forever. I love you, Suzanne. And my brother, Joseph Michael Giacconi. 18 years ago, you disappeared, but you will never, ever be forgotten. And we choose to remember you how you lived and not how you died. We miss you every day.
Robert Ekna. Constantine Economos. Barbara G. Edwards. Dennis Michael Edwards. Michael Hardy Edwards. Christine Egan. Lisa Aaron Egan. Martin J. Egan, Jr. Michael Egan. Samantha Martin Egan. Carol Eggert. Lisa Karen Erich. John Ernst Eichler. Eric Adam Eisenberg. Daphne Ferlinda Elder. Michael J. Affairs. Mark Joseph Ellis. Valerie Silver Ellis. Albert Alfie William Elmery. Robert R. Elseth. Edgar Hendricks Emery Jr. Doris Sukyuen Ang. Christopher Epps. Uf Ram Erickson. Erwin L. Erker. William John Erwin. Sarah Ali Escarcega. Jose Espinal. Fanny Espinoza. Billy Scoop Esposito. Bridget Ann Esposito. Frankie Esposito. Michael A. Esposito. Ruben Esquilin Jr. Sadie Et. Barbara G. Etzgold. Eric Brian Evans. Robert Edward Evans. Meredith Emily June Ewart. Catherine K. Fagan. And my brother, Andrew Ira Rosenblum. Andrew, we think of you every day. You're loved. And you now have a two-year-old grandson who is your namesake, Andrew Ira Rosenblum. And as he grows, the family will let him know all about you and what a wonderful person you were. You are missed. And my aunt, Lisa Marie Terry, we come together today to remember and cherish your life and all of the lives cut so senselessly short. We, we are here to say to our, those who are left behind and to those who have been lost, we love you and we will never forget you. Patricia Mary Fagan. Ivan Kirillos Fairbanks Barbosa. Keith George Fairbanks. Sandra Fajardo Smith. Charles S. Falkenberg. Dana Falkenberg. Zoe Falkenberg. Jamie L. Fallon. William F. Fallon. William Lawrence Fallon, Jr. Anthony J. Fallone, Jr. Dolores Bridget Finelli. Robert John Fangman. Thomas James Farino. Kathleen Ann Farragher. Paige Marie Farley Hackle. Nancy C. Dolaziski Farley. Douglas John Farnham. Elizabeth Ann Farmer. John W. Farrell. John Gerard Farrell. Joseph D. Farley. Terence Patrick Farrell. Syed Abdul Fata. Thomas Patrick Farrelly. Wendy R. Faulkner. Christopher Edward Fawnen. Bernard D. Favuza. Shannon Marie Fava. Ronald Carl Fazio Sr. Robert Fazio Jr. Francis Jude Feely. William M. Feehan. Sean Bernard Fagan. Garth Aaron Feeney. Peter Adam Fiedelberg. Lee S. Bailey. Rosa Maria Feliciano. Alan D. Feinberg. And my mother, Joan Donna Griffith, who encouraged all of us to be the wind and not the leaf. And her wind has produced a daughter who was a lawyer, a mother, and a leader. And grandchildren, Taryn Joan, Caden, Austin, and Anna Lee. And we all love and miss you dearly. 
and my brother-in-law, Port Authority Police Officer, Paul William Jurgens. Paul, you always were and always will be our hero. Edward P. Felt. Edward Thomas Fergus, Jr. George J. Ferguson III. J. Joseph Ferguson. Henry Fernandez. Judy Hazel Santillan Fernandez. Julio Fernandez. Elisa Giselle Farina. Anne Marie Salerin Ferreira. Robert John Ferris. David Francis Ferrugio. Louis V. Fersini, Jr. Michael David Ferrugio. Bradley James Vettit. Jennifer Louise Fialco. Kristen Nicole Fidel. Amelia V. Fields. Samuel Fields. Alexander Milan Filipov. Michael Bradley Finnegan. Timothy J. Finnerty. Michael C. Fiore. Stephen J. Fiorelli. Paul M. Fiore. John B. Fiorito. John R. Fisher. Andrew Fisher. Bennett Lawson Fisher. Gerald P. Fisher. John Roger Fisher. Thomas J. Fisher. Lucy A. Fishman. Ryan D. Fitzgerald. Thomas James Fitzpatrick. Richard P. Fitzsimmons. Salvatore, Salvatore Fume Freda. Darlene E. Flagg. Wilson F. Flagg. Christina Donovan Flannery. Eileen Fletcher. And my dad, Stephen Francis Schlag. Thank you for giving us the mountains. We feel a lot closer to you on top of them. It's 88 and sunny. I love you. And my uncle, firefighter Christopher Michael Mazzillo. We all miss you so much. Mom says I have your wavy hair, dairy devil spirit, and love of experimenting with food and playing soccer. We know you are with us on long car rides and roller coasters. Kira, Caprina, and I want you to know that we think about you all the time. Every time I'm on the soccer field, I think of you. You help me score goals. We love you so much, and you will always hold a special place in our hearts. We love you. Andre G. Fletcher. Carl M. Flickinger. Matthew M. Flacco. John Joseph Florio. Joseph Wolken Flounders. Carol Ann Blazek. David Fudor. Michael N. Fodor. Stephen Mark Fogel. Thomas J. Foley. Jane C. Folger. David J. Fontana. Chi Min Fu. Delrose E. Forbes Cheatham. Godwin Ford. Donald A. Foreman. Christopher Hugh Forsythe. Claudia Alicia Foster. Noel John Foster. Sandra N. Foster. Anna Fosteris. Robert Joseph Foti. Jeffrey Fox. Virginia Elizabeth Fox. Pauline Francis. Virgin Lucy Francis. Gary J. Frank. Morton H. Frank. Peter Christopher Frank. Colleen L. Fraser. Richard K. Fraser. Kevin J. Frawley. Clyde Fraser Jr. Lillian Inez Frederick. Andrew Fredericks. Tamitha Freeman. Fred Owen Friedman. Peter L. Freund. Arlene Ava Freed. Alan W. Friedlander. And my son-in-law, Thomas A. Mann. Tom, you are Shay's guardian angel, and she feels your presence every day. We all love and miss you. And my cousin, John J. Badagliaka. John, we love you and we miss you so very much, and not a day goes by that we're not thinking of you. 
you'll never be forgotten. Andrew Keith Freeman, Paul J. Friedman, Greg J. Frona, Lisa Ann Frost, Peter Christian Fry, Clement A. Fumando, Stephen Elliot Furman, Paul James Fermato, Carlton Douglas B. Fife, Frederick Neil Gabler, Richard Peter Gabriel, Richard S. Gabriel, James Andrew Gadelli, Pamela Lee Gaff, Erwin Vincent Galliard, Deanna Lynn Galante and her unborn child, Grace Catherine Galante, Anthony Edward Gallagher, Daniel James Gallagher, John Patrick Gallagher, Lourdes J. Galetti, Kono E. Gallo, Vincent Gallucci, Thomas E. Galvin, Giovanna Galetta Gambali, Firefighter Thomas Gambino Jr. of Rescue 3, Gian F. Gamboa, Ronald L. Gamboa, Peter James Gansey Jr., Michael Gann, Charles William Gabarini, Andrew Sonny Garcia, Cesar R. Garcia, David Garcia, Jorge Luis Monroe Garcia, Juan Garcia, Marlon Del Carmen Garcia, Christopher Samuel Gardner, Douglas Benjamin Gardner, Harvey Joseph Gardner III, and my brother Christopher Samuel Epps. Our family always thinks about you. We will call you in every aspect of our lives. You are deeply missed. Not a day go by that you are mentioned to us by someone. We love you deeply and we will always cherish your memory. Your life has been taken and you were not able to fulfill your dreams and aspirations, but what you left here is just as powerful and we are so grateful for and thankful to have you as a brother and a family member in our lives. And this country in 18 years, you would think that have made changes to bring us to more peace. However, gun violence is on the rampant. And I hope today that legislation continues to move forward and banning guns and getting them out of the hands of ind innocent individuals so that we can live in a world of peace and the home of the brave. Thank you. And my brother, Brian Daniel Fitzgerald, who worked for Fiduciary Trust, not a day goes by, but we don't think you're gonna walk through that door. And thank you for always looking over mom and dad, Caroline, Darcy, and all the cousins. Thank you. Jeffrey Brian Gardner. Thomas A. Gardner. William Arthur Gardner. Frank Garfi. Rocco Nino Gargano. James A. Gartenberg. Matthew David Garvey. Bruce Gary. Boyd Allen Gatton. Donald Richard Gavigan Jr. Peter Allen Gay. Terrence D. Gavigan. Gary Paul Guidel. Paul Hamilton Geyer. Julie M. Geis. Peter Gerard Galinas. Stephen Paul Geller. Howard G. Jelling Jr. P. 
Peter Victor Jenko Jr. Stephen Gregory Genovese. Elaine Gentil. Linda M. George. Edward F. Garrity. Susan Gerardi. Ralph Gerhard. Robert Gerlich. Dennis P. Germain. Marina Ramonvana Gertzberg. Susan M. Getzendana. Lawrence D. Getzford. James G. Geyer. Cortez G. Joseph M. Giacome. Vincent Francis Giamona. Deborah Lynn Gibbon. James Andrew Gibbs Giberson. Brenda C. Gibson. Craig Neil Gibson. Ronnie E. Geese. Andrew Cleve Gibber Gilbert. And my father, Edward Calderon, who will forever live in our hearts. We miss you and we love you dearly. We will continue to live in your legacy and I will always share my memories with my baby girl. And my father, Walter Matuza. I miss you every day. I wish I could spend some time on the beach with you and fish. Thank you. Timothy Paul Gilbert. Paul Stewart Gilby. Paul John Gill. Mark Y. Giles. Evan Hunter Gillette. Robert Lawrence Gilligan. Rodney C. Gillis. Laura Gilly. John F. Ginley. Donna Marie Giordano. Jeffrey John Giordano. John Giordano. Stephen A. Giordetti. Martin Giovanazzo. Kum Kum Girolamo. Salvatore Gito. Cynthia Juke Gliano. Manjan Lavage. Diane Gladstone. Keith Alexander Glasgow. Thomas Irwin Glasser. Edmund Glasser. Harry Glane. Barry H. Glick. Jeremy Logan Glick. Stephen Glick. John T. Nazo. William Robert Godshalk. Michael Galliarmella. Brian F. Goldberg. Jeffrey G. Goldflam. Michelle Goldstein. Monica Goldstein. Stephen Ian Goldstein. Ronald F. Golinski. Andrew H. H. Golkin. Dennis James Gomes. Enrique Antonio Gomez. Jose Bienvenido Gomez. Manuel Gomez, Jr. And my sister, Patrice Paz, whose leadership ensured the safety of many, but was lost when she went to find a missing coworker. You will always be my hero. And my mother, Frances Harrows. Good morning, brothers and sisters in good faith. Listen, some people did something. I am here today to honor my 76-year-old mother, Frances, on the solemn 18th anniversary of the 9-11 attacks. Mom, we all miss you and love you very much. This day I also remember over 200 personal friends and co-workers that I knew that died. I remember Virginia Fox, Warren Grifka, and Lou Avasano. And I remember your sons and your daughters, your parents and siblings, and all first responders. I remember all, I remember them all, and pray with you for them today. Some people did something, said a freshman congresswoman from Minnesota, to support and justify the creation of care. Today I am here to respond to you exactly who did what to whom. Madam, objectively speaking, we know who and what was done. There is no uncertainty about that. Why your confusion? On that day, 19 Islamic terrorist members of Al-Qaeda killed over 3,000 people and caused billions of dollars of economic damage. 
Is that clear? But as to whom? I was attacked. Your relatives and friends were attacked. Our constitutional freedoms were attacked. And our nation's founding on Judeo-Christian principles were attacked. That's what some people did. Got that now? We are here today, Congresswoman, to tell you and the squad just who did what to whom. Show respect in honoring them, please. American patriotism and your position demand it. For God and country, amen. Alfredo Gomez. Janine Nicole Gonzalez. Mauricio Gonzalez. Rosa J. Gonzalez. Lynn Catherine Goodchild. Calvin Joseph Gooding. Peter Morgan Goodrich. Harry Goody. Kiran Kumar Reddy Goku. Catherine C. Gorevi. Lisa Fenn Gordonstein. Kareen Gordon. Sebastian Gorky. Kieran Joseph Gorman. Thomas Edward Gorman. Michael Edward Gold. O. Kristen Osterholm White Gould. Douglas Allen Golwell. Yuji Goya. John Richard Grabowski. Christopher Michael Grady. Edwin J. Graf III. David Martin Graithman. Gilbert Franco Granados. Lauren Catuzzi Grancolis. Elvira Granito. Winston Arthur Grant. Christopher S. Gray. Ian J. Gray. James Michael Gray. Tara McLeod Gray. John M. Grazioso. Timothy George Grazioso. Derek Arthur Green. Wade B. Green. Wanda Anita Green. Elaine Myra Greenberg. Donald Freeman Green. Gail R. Green. James Arthur Greenleaf Jr. And my father, firefighter, Martin Nicholas DeMeo, of Hazmat Company One. We miss you, we love you, and we know that you're proud of us. And my father, Scott, firefighter, Scott Larson. We love and we miss you. Keep watching over us. Eileen Marsha Greenstein. Elizabeth Martin Gregg. Denise Marie Gregory. Donald H. Gregory. Florence Moran Gregory. Pedro Grayhan. John Michael Griffin. Tawana Sherry Griffin. Joan Donna Griffith. Warren Grifka. Ramon B. Grijalvo. Joseph F. Grillo. David Joseph Grimner. Francis Edward Grogan. Linda Groglin. Kenneth George Gruzales. Joseph Grislak. Matthew James Grzmalski.
Robert Joseph Bouchard. Liming Gu. Richard J. Guadango. Jose A. Guadalupe. Cindy Yan Zhu Wan. Jeffrey E. Guja. Joseph P. Gullickson. Babita Girjamati Guman. Douglas Brian Gurian. Janet Ruth Gustafson. Philip T. Guza. Barbara Guzardo. Peter Mark Gulavari. Gary Robert Haig. Andrea Lynn Haberman. Barbara Mary Habib. Philip Hensler. Nezam A. Hafiz. Karen Elizabeth Haggerty. Stephen Michael Haggis. Mary Lou Haig. David Halderman. And my cousin, firefighter Salvatore B. Calabro. You're always in our hearts. You will never be missed, and you will never be forgotten. Elvin, my brother-in-law, was a proud and loving father to Gabriella and Alexander, a dedicated son, brother, uncle, nephew, cousin, and a devoted husband to my sister, Diane. His legacy lives on in all those who were touched by his magic and his kindness, especially his extended family, Ludwickies, Samets, Hines, Soffings, Romeros, and Meads. Our family is a circle of love that has not been broken by his loss, but made stronger by the memories. Miley Rachel Hale. Diane Hale McKenzie. Richard B. Hall. Stanley R. Hall. Vaswell George Hall. Robert J. Halligan. Vincent Gerard Halloran. Carolyn B. Halliman. James Douglas Halverson. Mohammed Salman Hamdani. Felicia Hamilton. Robert W. Hamilton. Carl Max Hammond Jr. Frederick K. Han. Christopher James Hanley. Sean S. Hanley. Valerie Joanne Hanna. Thomas Paul Hannafin. Kevin James Hannaford Sr. Michael Lawrence Hannon. Dana Ray Hannon. Christine Lee Hansen. Peter Burton Hansen. Sue Kim Hansen. Vasilios G. Haramis. James A. Haran. Gerard Francis Hardacre. Jeffrey Pike Hardy. T. J. Hargrave. Daniel Edward Harlan. Francis Harrows. Harvey L. Harrow. Stephen J. Harrow. Melissa Harrington Hughes. Aisha Ann Harris. Stuart D. Harris. John Patrick Hart. Eric Hartono. John Clinton Hart. Eric Harvey. And my brother Gary Shamai, whose life and legacy are memorialized and celebrated on this 18th anniversary of 9-11 by all those that revered and loved him. Today, I mean, I am very deeply honored and humbled to have my brother's namesake, my beloved son, Gary Shamai, up here on this podium alongside of me to take part in this proud tradition of perpetuating the memories of all those we lost on this tragic day 18 years ago by reading and sanctifying some of their names. May the life and memory of my brother and your uncle, Gary Shamai, be forever etched in the hearts and minds of all those lives that he has touched in the short time he was here with us on this earth. I love you, Gary. May God bless you so. And my uncle, Gary Shabai, I wish I could spend time with you and get to know you. I love you and wish you were here with me. Peter Paul Hashem. Thomas Theodore Haskell, Jr. Timothy Sean Haskell. Joseph John Hassan III. Leonard W. Hatton, Jr. 
Terrence S. Hatton. Michael Helmut Hull. Timothy Aaron Haviland. Donald G. Havlish, Jr. Anthony Maurice Hawkins. Nobuhiro Hayatsu. James Edward Hayden. Robert J. Hayes. Philip T. Hayes, retired. W. Ward Haynes. Scott Jordan Hazelcorn. Michael K. Healy. Roberta B. Heber. Charles Francis Xavier Heron. John F. Heffernan. Michelle M. Heidenberger. Sheila M. S. Hein. H. Joseph Heller, Jr. Joanne L. Heltebridal. Ronald John Hemingway. Mark F. Hemscott. Ronnie Lee Henderson. Brian Hennessy. Edward R. Hennessy, Jr. Michelle Marie Henrique. Joseph Patrick Henry. William L. Henry, Jr. Katharina Henry Robinson. John Christopher Henwood. Robert Allen Hepburn. Mary Herencia. Lindsay C. Harkness III. Harvey Robert Hermer. Norberto Hernandez. Raul Hernandez. And my uncle, Abul K. Chaudhry, a proud Muslim American man who lived his life with a carefree nature, a zeal for adventure, and a tenacity which I emulate every single day. I'm keeping my promise to you that no matter how old I grow, I'll still not act my age. And I hope you've been practicing your can up there because I've been practicing my Chun Li, and I promise now we can kick your butt. Ami tomake onek onek palo bashi. And my cousin, New York City fireman, Thomas Joseph Kavakis. Been 18 years, it never gets any easier, but the one thing I will do is fulfill my promise to never forget. The brothers and I will get together this afternoon. We'll talk about you and the other brothers and those that have gone since. By the way, regards and love from your brothers and sisters, Christine, Karen, Jimmy, Timmy, and Kathy. Love you, cuz, and I'll see you on the other side someday. Gary Harold. Jeffrey Allen Hirsch. Thomas J. Hetzel. Leon Bernard Hayward, MC Sundance. Brian Christopher Hickey. And Emencio Dario Hidalgo Cedeno. Timothy Brian Higgins. Robert D. W. Higley II. Todd Russell Hill. Clara Victorine Hines. Neil O. Hines. Mark Hindi. Katsuyuki Hirai. Heather Malia Ho. Tara Yvette Hobbs. Thomas Anderson Hobbs. James J. Hogan. Robert Wayne Hobson III. Dejuan Hodges. Ronald G. Horner. Patrick A. Hoey. John A. Hoffer. Marsha Hoffman. Stephen Gerard Hoffman. Frederick Joseph Hoffman. Michelle L. Hoffman. Judith Florence Hoffmiller. Wallace Cole Hogan, Jr. Thomas Warren Holweck, Jr. Jonathan R. Homan. Cora Hidalgo Holland. John Holland. Joseph F. Holland. Jimmy I. Holly. Elizabeth Holmes. Thomas P. Hullahan. Herbert Wilson Homer. Leroy W. Homer, Jr. Bradley V. Horn. James P. Hopper. And my sister, Roseanne Patricia Lang, and my nephew, Brendan Lang. 18 years later, it still cuts like a knife. We miss you until we meet again. And my grandmother, Ruth Sheila Lapin. Even though I never met her, through the stories I've heard, I know my grandmother was an amazing person. She was kind and smart and was great at bringing others together. She influenced many people, including my mom, my siblings, and me, to be kind, funny, and accepting of others. I love you and I miss you, Grammy Ruth. 
Montgomery McCullough Horde. Michael Joseph Horn. Matthew Douglas Horning. Robert L. Borohu, Jr. Michael Robert Horrocks. Aaron Horowitz. Charles J. Houston. Uhoro Houston. Angela M. Houts. George Gerard Howard. Brady K. Howell. Michael C. Howell. Stephen Leon Howell. Jennifer L. Howley. Milagros Romada. Marion R. Harokak. Stephen Bushko, Jr. Chris Robert Hughes, Jr. Paul Rexford Hughes. Robert T. Hughes, Jr. Thomas F. Hughes, Jr. Timothy Robert Hughes. Susan Huey. Lamar Demetrius Jose. John Nicholas Humber, Jr. William Christopher Hunt. Kathleen Ann Hunt Casey. Joseph Gerard Hunter. Peggy M. Hurt. Robert R. Hussa. Stephen N. Highland, Jr. Robert J. Hymo. Thomas Edward Hines. Walter G. Hines. Joseph Anthony Ionelli. Zuhutu Ibisis. Jonathan Lee ELP. Michael Patrick Iken. Daniel Ilkanaev. Frederick J. Ill Jr. And my mother, Yvonne Kennedy, who dedicated over 30 years of her life to the Australian Red Cross and lived a life of inclusion, a life of compassion, equality, and compassion and humanity. And if there is one legacy that she leaves is that we all, no matter the colour, no matter the creed, no matter the religion, and no matter your tribe, live our lives with the same humanity that she did. And my mother, Barbara P. Walsh. The void in our hearts, Mom, will never heal. You'll be so proud of us, your family, your grandchildren. They're getting so big. We know that you're always looking down on us, sending crazy signs. Mom, please continue to give us strength to get past this horrific day. We love you, and we will always miss you, and you will always be forever in our heart. God bless America. Abraham Nathanel Iliots. Anthony P. Infante Jr. Louis S. Ingaltera. Christopher Noble Ingracia. Paul Inella. Stephanie Veronica Earby. Douglas Jason Eardgang. Kristen Irvine Ryan. Todd Antoine Isaac. Eric Hans Bronston. Taizo Ishikawa. Walid Joseph Iskandar. Aram Iskandarian Jr. John F. Iskian. Kazushike Ito. Alexander Valerievich Ivansov. Lacey Bernard Ivory. Virginia May Yablonski. Brian C. Jack. Brooke Alexandra Jackman. Aaron Jeremy Jacobs. Ariel Lewis Jacobs. Jason Kyle Jacobs. Michael G. Jacobs. Stephen A. Jacobson. Stephen D. Jacoby. Rick Noth Jaggernoth. Jake Dennis Yagoda. Yudvir S. Jane. Maria Yakubiak. Robert Adrian Jalbert. Ernest James. Grisilda E. James. Mark Stephen Jardim. Amy Nicole Jarrett. Muhammadu Jawara. Francois Jean Pierre. Maxima Jean Pierre. Paul Edward Jeffers. John Charles Jenkins. And my cousin, Port Authority Police Officer, David Prudence Lamagne. There truly isn't a day that passes that we don't think about you and about this tragic day. We love you and we miss you. 
and my dear aunt Marina Romanovna Gerritsberg. Though I haven't met you, I've been told many great things about you. You are forever in all our minds and in our hearts. Love you and miss you dearly. Joseph Jenkins, Jr. Alan Keith Jensen. Prem Nath Giraffe. Farah Judy. Huayda Jian. Eliza Jimenez, Jr. Luis Jimenez, Jr. Charles Gregory John. Nicholas John. Dennis M. Johnson. Lashona Johnson. Scott Michael Johnson. William R. Johnston. Allison Horstman Jones. Arthur Joseph Jones III. Brian Leander Jones. Charles Edward Jones. Christopher D. Jones. Donald T. Jones II. Donald W. Jones. Judith Lauter Jones. Linda Jones. Mary S. Jones. Andrew Brian Jordan Sr. Robert Thomas Jordan. Albert Gunnis Joseph. Ingeborg Joseph. Carl Henry Joseph. Stephen Joseph. Jane Eileen Josiah. Anthony Jovic. Angel L. Warbe Jr. Karen Sue Jude. Ann C. Judge. Michael F. Judge. Paul William Jurgens. Thomas Edward Jurgens. Shashi Kiran Lakshmikanta Kadaba. Gavroy Kamar Dinova. Shari Kandel. And my cousin, Brian Christopher Hickey. Brian, to say you missed would be an understatement. Uh, you were a, a cousin, a friend, and a mentor wrapped into one. I thank you for that. You conducted yourself with class and integrity, so be rest assured your legacy and your soul are intact. I can't believe it's been 18 years. May you rest in peace, and don't worry, Brian. We, and when I say we, I'm talking about a whole lot of people, we will never forget. And my sister, Judith Ann Reese. Judy, it has been 18 years since we lost you, and we miss you every day. We miss your presence and all that you meant to us. We miss your awesome deviled eggs that you made for our holiday dinners. We miss how much you love country western music, especially Garth Brooks. We miss this and so much more. As you know, we were all deeply saddened with the passing of Elizabeth a few months ago. You and she were incredible sisters and friends, and we take comfort knowing that you welcomed her into heaven with open arms. We all miss you both very much, and we know that you are both watching over all of us. Judy, your nephews and niece and their spouses, Michael and Loma, Brian and Jackie, Kevin and Eileen, Christine and Joseph, and Dennis and Holly are wonderful people, and they are raising incredible children. And please know that we felt the love and presence of both you and Elizabeth at Emily and Justin's wedding a few weeks ago. As one sports season begins and another one comes to a close, I know that you will be cheering for your Redskins and Elizabeth will be cheering for her Yankees. Well, goodbye for now. We love you both. May God bless all the families of 9-11. May God bless our first responders, our firefighters, our police officers, and all in our military. Howard Lee Kane. Jennifer Lynn Kane. Vincent D. Kane. June Kuhn Kang. Sheldon Robert Cantor. Deborah H. Kaplan. Robin Lynn Kaplan. Alvin Peter Kaplan, Jr. Charles H. Karcheski. William A. Carnes. Douglas Jean Karpiloff. Charles L. Casper. Andrew K. Cates. John A. Kasmanis. Robert Michael Colfers. 
Don Jerome Kuth Jr. Hideo Kawauchi. Edward T. Keen. Richard M. Keen. Lisa Yvonne Carney Griffin. Carol Ann Kiesler. Barbara A. Keating. Paul Hamlin Keating. Leo Russell Keen III. Brenda Kegler. Chandler Raymond Keller. Joseph John Keller. Peter R. Kellerman. Joseph P. Kellett. Frederick H. Kelly III. James Joseph Kelly. Joseph A. Kelly. Maurice P. Kelly. Richard John Kelly Jr. Thomas Michael Kelly. Thomas Richard Kelly. Thomas W. Kelly. Timmy Colin Kelly. William Hill Kelly Jr. Robert Clinton Kennedy. And my cousin, Alfred Anton Bucosa. And my brother, fighter fighter Paul Hanley Keating. Paul, you lived right down the street, ran into the firehouse, ran into a burning building, and never came out. We're proud of him, but we miss him every single day. Thomas J. Kennedy. Yvonne E. Kennedy. John Richard Kehane. Ralph Francis Kershaw. Ronald T. Kerwin. Howard L. Kestenbaum. Douglas D. Ketchum. Ruth Ellen Kettler. Boris Califf. Norma Cruz Khan. Sarah Khan. Tamor Faraz Khan. Rayesh Handawal. Sele Ku. Michael Vernon Kipa. Satoshi Kikuchihara. Andrew J. Hoon Kim. Lawrence Don Kim. Mary Jo Kimmelman. Heinrich Kimmig. Karen Ann Kincaid. Amy R. King. Andrew M. King. Lucille Teresa King. Robert King Jr. Lisa King Johnson. Brian K. Kenny. Takashi Kinoshita. Chris Michael Kirby. Robert Kirkpatrick. Howard Barry Kirschbaum. Glenn Davis Kerwin. Helen Crossan Kittle. Richard Joseph Claras. Peter Anton Klein. Alan David Kleinberg. Karen Joyce Klitzman. Ronald Philip Klepfer. Stephen A. Knapp. Eugenie Niazov. And my father, Deputy Chief Raymond Downey, my hero. Dad, we miss you, we love you. There's not a day that go by that we don't think of you. We cherish the memories that you gave us. You would be so proud of your five children, 16 grandchildren, your beautiful wife, Rosalie, the rock of our family, who continues to keep your memory alive. And my two brothers keep their legacy. I love you, Dad, until we meet again. And for my uncles, Mark and Stephen Kaleo, they truly represented the idea that there are so many beautiful reasons to be happy and to stay hopeful in life. God bless America. Andrew James Knox. Thomas Patrick Knox. Rebecca Lee Kabori. Deborah A. Kobus. Gary Edward Keckler. Frank J. Costner. Ryan Cohart. Vanessa Lynn Shibelo Kolpak. 